what is going on everyone so this is a huge deal that we just found out so in case you guys haven't seen it already basically they're interviewing on tv and then one of the news reporters accidentally says naked shorts so let me try to play it it's probably gonna be hard to hear but either way if you haven't seen it already feel free to like go on reddit or just youtube and let me just play it really quick and see if you can hear it and us versus them um I, i'm sorry i'm not i'm not buying into that i think that's dangerous and, and again look there's a lot of people there are a lot of short sellers out there that have been borrowing stock they didn't have in other words yes i think there are dynamics yours, where yeah. retail investors can get caught but it's 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 really a, a dynamic where i think this is going ah! so just look at that right there you kind of probably won't be able to hear it that get a mario but just go and check out the videos and basically, he's just talking, the dude, and then all of a sudden, she says naked shorts as if she was trying to reply to what he was trying to explain. And the guy never actually says that. And next thing you know it, you can see her face. She's like in shock as if like, oh my gosh, I can't believe I just said that. Now, this is just one of the first times I think we've seen them actually say that term because a lot of people were speculating for months, right? Even on Reddit, you can check out. And there's a post back, I think it was like two months ago. Let me see if I can find the exact post. This one right here. And this was two months ago. This dude was already tweeting. You can see even at the timeline. Talking about investigating synthetic shares and naked short with AMC and GME. And this is, you know, targeting the, um, you know, SEC commissioner to look into this stuff. So this was months ago. People were already speculating stuff that pretty much we've all assumed was the thing. Yet there was not really any real confirmation yet. And now we see it all over TV. Now, everybody's talking about this now. Now, what does this mean? Well, first of all, let's just look at some things too. Because this doesn't necessarily have 100% confirmation yet. This is just somebody who said it without really meaning to say it, it seems like, again. But another post on Reddit. This is another one. Same thing. Check it out. But basically, one thing I want to show you guys is this. Here's this uh, little... This is off Reddit too, by the way. But if you guys watched the interview with Trey Trades and um, CEO, basically at a certain point, he his camera like like fell. I don't even know how that's possible. I guess if he's recording on like a phone maybe, but I mean, I'm assuming it's on a laptop again. But either way, it it just fell and like the man's not wearing any pants. And then like the jokes, like the naked shorts, literally, he's not wearing pants. And you read his post, he talks about this, that... um. Legally, he said he can't say anything regarding that stuff. Obviously, I'm guessing, you know, since he's a top exec, it just doesn't make sense to say things like that when um, legally things could go wrong. So he never mentioned it, apparently. But dude had no pants on. And then he was saying, like, what if this is a way to say that there's naked shorts going on without getting in trouble? And now we see the interview, this post, um, this uh, interview here. And then two... If we go to the picture, like, literally, he's not wearing, like, obviously, you guys can watch the, the interview, but, like, how is this even possible? Like, is he recording on a webcam, or does he have it just straight on the web? I don't even know how that makes sense. Like, I'm guessing he has a phone or something, but either way, like, like, if you watch the interviews, like, it just fell. Like, it just randomly fell. And either way, plus, he's, like, sitting so far back. Like, if he has a table, typically, you're sitting under the table, right, when you're interviewing. Like, how hard is it to show your legs when you're doing, like, a Zoom call? Like, try think about it. Like, I'm, like, I, like right now when I'm, I'm filming, I'm sitting under the table. So, for him to be so far back, that, that does, I don't know. It doesn't make any sense. But either way, we saw the interview. And basically, now, guess what? Now, people on Reddit, they forwarded this petition here. For sure, it's probably going to get all the signatures. But, again, this is basically staying to um, investigate the illegal naked shorty. Now, in case you guys don't know what naked shorts are, they give a quick, uh, quick brief um, summary. But let's just go to like uh, Investopedia to see like the actual definition. So first off, let's just go look at what naked shorting is. All right. So first off, it is illegal. It's an illegal practice of short selling. So first off, it's it's not even legal one. And basically, the shares that have not been affirmatively determined to exist. So. Typically, what they do is traders must borrow a stock or determine that it can be borrowed before they can sell it shorts. So since naked shorting is when you're first to the short pressure on a stock that may be larger than the tradable shares in the market. And apparently, a lot of people still do this that I've seen. I obviously don't have the actual data, but 
there's some people who got in trouble for this, you know, a few years back, which I'll show you in a second. But basically, they said despite making it illegal after the 0809 crisis, naked shorting continues to happen. Like, they still say because there's loopholes in the rules and discrepancies and electric trading systems. So, pretty much, that's like the main summary, right? Now, even under here, you can see understanding naked shorting impacts of it. But look at the impact. So, it can actually affect the liquidity of a particular security within the marketplace. So, when a particular share is not readily available guess what negative short selling allows a person to participate even though they are unable to actually obtain a share like think about that if additionally investors can be interested in a shares associated with these sorting this can cause an increase in liquidity associated with the shares as demand within the marketplace increases so basically you can see how this can be problematic but um basically you can see down here there's uh examples of people who did it and they got charged like back in um 2014 Two people looks like um, they actually end up making four hundred k in revenue, and then basically they got caught. I guess so. That's something that's big. That's a big deal. And then obviously in this petition, you can see they give more of a definition on what it does and why they want people to look into it. But now that the word's out, guess what? The apes, the Reddit community, they're not gonna stop. They're gonna be on Twitter. They're gonna go on social media. Everybody's gonna be sharing this stuff. So definitely share this video with your friends. Even the Twitter post, anything that showcases um, just acknowledgement for people to look into this, to let more people know, like, hey, what is going on? Are they doing this? Is this illegal? What is happening? Just so we can get confirmation for sure on what's actually going on behind the scenes, because right now we don't have much info besides what we can access ourselves, right? And obviously the market today is closed, but just looking at the current price, we are at $47, it looks like 91 cents. And if all this information is starting to be um, opened up and we start to figure out the real details, guess what? It might be potentially just getting started. But again, guys, just remember this video is my own opinion. This is not financial advice. Be sure you're reach before making any investments. But uh, AMC right now, once the market opens up next week, we'll have to wait and see. I'll make some updates before then. But uh, pretty much, that's crazy to see. Current price was still up significantly from the lows. Yet, um, now we have some new data to base it on. So I'm assuming once market opens up next week, if this hype starts to continue, more people start talking about this, where it starts to spread, guess what? AMC could could go crazy. It could. But it might take some time, though. It's not going to happen overnight if it, everything is true. Like, so don't expect it on Monday or whatever day um, you check it that AMC goes crazy. We don't know yet, all right? We can't predict the top. But until then... Just share any content you see around this type of stuff to people. Let them know what's going on so they can be educated. And then and do some research too on naked shorts, conspiracies, and all that stuff to get yourself better aware of like really what's going on. If it makes sense and you actually understand it versus just looking at you know posts online. But definitely let me know your thoughts, your predictions on AMC in the comments below. And I'll see you guys in the next one.